Hello everyone, Scott with Heritage Farms Texas. Happy Sunday afternoon. We're at the corporate offices here at uh, Heritage Farms and hey, let me show you something we have to work with. Hey guys, okay, look at this man. We got very, very, very lucky. The good people over at Badger Power Equipment reached out to us and asked us if we would be interested in looking at their 52cc power blower backpack power blower and i tell you what man this thing is a beast it is well designed it's laid out it's kimber approved but i mean this thing is just crazy i mean it runs on uh, two cycle oil uh, i just started it up just for a second because i wanted to make sure that it was running and we could get it started i have very little gas in here so i'm gonna try my best to actually uh, get this thing going you know a couple of little things i noticed was right here uh, we got a little bit of a broken piece of plastic, but all in all, I mean, I've looked at some others, some steel and some echoes before. It seems like it's well made. So I'm going to get this thing started. I'm going to turn it over to my beautiful assistant, the lovely Miss Heritage Farms, and uh, let's see what happens. So I also wanted to include, just to kind of go over some of the features that this thing had. It's of course 52 cc's, uh, it's a two stroke, you know, they say uh, like 80 to one, or excuse me, 50 to one ratio is the recommended two cycle oil. This thing does put out 80 uh, decibel points, so make sure you're wearing hear, hearing protection. It's got a really easy start. I want you to look how great this is. They labeled this start and run. You got your little, uh, there's your choke for your motor. Right over here, you have a bulb. When you first start it, you press that three times. They claim that this blower design puts out 20% more airflow than some of the competitors' brands. It has a very nice, easy to use uh, feature. Got your trigger for your speed. You also have a three-stage switch. You have stop, you have start, and then you also have like a cruise control or a speed adjustment that you can set and hold the speed. On the back side here, you do have uh, adjustable shoulder straps, which make it very nice. You also have a uh, strap right here that you can go around your waist. 
that keeps it. You do have nice padding. It's also got a good uh, insulated plastic back that will keep the heat from the motor and everything from getting up against your back. Uh, when I was wearing it earlier, it is lightweight. It seems to be very easy to carry. Uh, the snaps come on and off if you want to remove the harness or do some, make some adjustments. That all looks pretty good. All in all, man, a very well built piece of equipment. It stands up, got a nice carrying handle on the top. I like it, I like it a lot. All right, guys, let me tell you what, that's pretty cool. I need to adjust the straps. The straps weren't totally adjusted. Also, I got kind of got to get the feel for the wand because I'm left-handed, so uh, unfortunately, the only option you have is right-handed. But all in all, I'll tell you what, this has so much more power than the uh, little handheld steel I was using. I mean, man, this thing is gonna work great dividends. We're gonna put a link in the uh, description I'll also put a link up here in the corner that you can click on. Go check them out. I think you can get it on Amazon, probably also off their website. We'll definitely put a link. Hey, not sure what the retail price is on this, but let me tell you what, it's well-made. I like it. Uh, it's the first backpack blower I've had, and uh, we'll uh, give you an update and see how this thing uh, is performing a year from now as well. But hey, Badger Power Tools, thank you guys. As always, glory be to God and you guys have a great week.